Greetings and welcome to another Pokemon video. So, almost three months ago, I made a video on Pokemon that should get a regional form, aka a Paldean form, in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Now, originally, my intention was just to list Pokemon that deserve to get a regional form, either because they have been away from the spotlight for far too long, or because they are in dire need of something that can breathe new life into them slash make them relevant again. I was not going to actually say what the regional forms should look like or what they should be like. However, I instead ended up straight up designing the regional forms. I decided what they should look like and I even brought the design to life visually. I said what type they should be, what abilities they should have, etc. So the video ended up being a lot more involved and complex, while also being a lot more demanding and time consuming. But at the same time, it was also a lot of fun to make and I did enjoy making it. Now even though I ended up actually designing the original forms, my intent was still the same. I still simply wanted to list Pokemon that deserve a regional form. I just took it up a notch and the video ended up being more about regional forms that I think should happen. Regional forms that I want to see. However, I never intended to predict what Pokemon will get a regional form. And I certainly did not intend to predict what the regional forms would look like or what they would be like. So even after I went the extra mile with the video, I did not think that I was predicting anything. And while I did design my regional forms by taking inspiration from real life, which is exactly what the actual Pokemon designers do, I never, ever in a million years thought that any of my ideas could become reality. But lo and behold, I was wrong. Very, very wrong. So, Tauros is one of the Pokemon that I featured in that video, and this is the original form I designed for Tauros. I took inspiration from the Spanish Bull, or Toro de Lidia, which are used for bull fighting. Since most of these bulls are black with white horns, I decided to have Tauros match this look. I opted to have the hooves and the end of the tails be white as well to match the horns. I also made the horns longer and curved, which matches the horns of all the Spanish bulls I saw in pictures. I also made this Tauros beefier to match the immense bulk that Spanish bulls have. For typing, since Spanish bulls fight in colosseums or arenas, I decided that fighting type would match this new Tauros very well, and it would also match the stronger physique the new Tauros has. For abilities, I said that all the abilities normal Tauros has would match the new Tauros as well. These abilities being Intimidate, Anger Point, and Cheer Force. But for variety's sake, I said that Moxie, Vital Spirit, and the Defiant would all match the new Tauros as well. Since Spanish Bulls are aggressive, full of stamina, and relentless, especially when provoked. So, that's my design for a regional form of Tauros. Pretty cool, huh? Now, Tauros did end up receiving a regional form in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Or rather, it got three regional forms. It goes without saying that I was very, very surprised when I learned that one of the Pokemon that I said should get a regional form actually got a regional form. However, the most surprising thing by far is the fact that the regional forms 
Tauros got are almost exactly the same as the one I designed. The combat breathe specifically is pretty much the same as my design. The only differences are that mine has white horns, white hooves, white fur at the end of its tails and its horns are longer and curved. But other than this, they are basically the same. Even down to having the same typing and, for the most part, the same abilities. Though not to sound arrogant, I do think that my design is cooler. Now of course, there's also the Blaze and Aqua Breeds, which are a little less like my design than the Combat Breed. But they both do feature the longer, curved horns that my design has, but the Combat Breed does not. And they still are the same color, with the same base abilities, and they are both still fighting type. Their tails and the fur around their torso are the only things that are different from my design. So yes, basically, for the most part, my design came true. The Paldean Tauros we got is pretty much the Paldean Tauros I created. Now of course, this shocked me to an unbelievable degree. I really, seriously could not believe that a Pokemon I designed actually became real. It honestly feels like I am dreaming. In fact, I am sure that a lot of people wish that they could have one of their designs or creations added to a game, movie, etc. There are even contests and competitions where the winner gets to do just this. So it really is crazy that this happened to me. Now I do want to go through everything that I thought when I saw Paldean Tauros in game for the first time. First, I thought, holy Arceus, I must really be some kind of prophet. Second, I thought, wait a minute, is it possible that they stole my design? But then I thought, no, there's no way. It's not like my video went viral and got millions of views. It only has almost 400 views at the time of recording this. So I seriously doubt that anyone at Game Freak watched my video. I also don't think that they would steal anyone's design. Or at least, I want to think that they wouldn't do this. There is also the fact that I came up with my design in the same way that they come up with their designs. We used real life as inspiration. In this case specifically, we took inspiration from the real life setting that inspired Scarlet and Violet. So it's very likely that we ended up with such similar designs purely because of coincidence. I guess that great minds really do think alike. Also, the Blaze and Aqua Breeds are a departure from what I designed. They feature several things that my design does not. So I really don't think that my design was stolen, and there really is no way to prove it either way. The third and final thing I thought was that Game Freak should hire me to be a character designer for them, because I was able to design something very similar to what they designed themselves, and I did this without any hint of what they were working on. And perhaps, I even did it first. So it's fair to say that I have the talent to be a great asset to them. Now before I end the video, I do want to say that I am not trying to sound conceited, or entitled, or anything like this. All the thoughts I had after seeing Paldi and Tauros were mostly me reacting to something completely insane with a hint of sarcasm and exaggeration. I was basically half joking and half serious about it. I just wanted to make sure 
that no one thinks that I am now full of myself because it, it just so happens that one of my designs became real. But that's everything I have for you in this video. This whole ordeal is definitely something crazy and surprising. It is honestly uncanny how similar my Paldean Tauros is to the actual Paldean Tauros. To the point that I still wonder if I am not just dreaming. And I honestly get the chills every time that I see it. Because I really cannot believe that this actually happened. But yeah, I just had to make a video bringing attention to this situation and sharing my thoughts on it. Because it truly is something special. Also, I will leave a link to the video with all my designs in the description below and at the end of this video. Because I think that that video deserves a lot more love, considering just how much passion and effort I put into it. So please check it out if you haven't already. But that's the video, as always. Leave your own thoughts down in the comments below, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and would like to see more like it, then please consider subscribing to my channel. I love Pokemon and I love making videos on both the anime and the games. Also, please consider clicking the links on screen so that you can check out more videos like this right away. Thank you very much for watching and let's meet again in the next video.